It is not related to any counterpart which belongs to the mind. Silence has nothing to do with it. Our song topics are basically about all Filipino topics, whether it be historical or current events. Matan Death March is about the Japanese occupation. Pangulo is about the U.S. occupation. But in the Basal is about the conflict of the Christian government and the Muslim resistance in the Philippines. Uh, songs like Catolicismo is about how Catholicism was brutally introduced to the Philippines. I mean, it's it's all like I, I, we write from what we know, so that's what we're doing. All right, welcome to another edition of Meet the Deaths. My parents call me the king of the deathmatch. This is the medic. The morning after Francis Boss Bus. Boom. And our newest acquisition, the world's first deaf rapper, White Zack. <laughs> Music creates an avenue to get out of the struggle, to get out of your soulful ghetto spiritual side of you. You get out of your spiritual ghetto into your spiritual paradise. Yeah, hey, if you know what that means, I'll give you a dollar. <laughs> Part of the reason I got into music, um, whether it was like punk rock, rock, or hip hop, it was, just, you know, it was artists like, as cheesy as this is, like U2. You know, there's something about U2 singing about what happened in Ireland on Sunday, Bloody Sunday, that was just like, oh, you know, what is that about? It made me want to learn. Um, you know, people say, and it's like a jungle sometimes, it makes me wonder how I keep from going under. It's like, okay, what is that about? You know, there's something, this person singing about something that's real to them. Um, I appreciated music like that. anything anyone else you know like whatever's been thrown at you during the day people are always like trying to bring you down just because you're different you know I mean I don't want to get into specifics but uh school family friends whatever you know we always have to face certain kind of things that bring us down so you know. life that's what I would say uh, the struggle pretty much it living in the United States um, it's not exactly um, not exactly always friendly to new people, particularly immigrants that come to the United States. Um, I think if I'm sure you all study Filipino American history, you know the experiences of you know the majority of people that come to this country. Um, my experience wasn't that much different. All kidding aside, my struggles are not political; they're philosophical. Because we'll never solve our problems through politics. That's just a man-made, stupid device for the powerful to control them. We'll never figure out our problems until we figure out why there's a part of the human existence that's just evil and fucked up and disgusting. And you know what? The people who do figure that out, Jesus Christ, Socrates, uh, Jim Morrison from The Doors, they get killed by politicians. So with that said, fuck carrots. 